Third and one pass by Dagan Hart. The 6'6 player will throw it downfield. It's going to be intercepted! Intercepted on the far side as Connor Romango will come up. The free safety who hails from Pittsburgh puts the Steeler hold that time on Dagan Hart who will throw his first pick this year. And it was a great defensive play by Connor, Kevin. It was a very good defensive play. That ball needs to be thrown a little further to the outside. Connor uses a little bit of physicality to put himself right in the right position and muscle his way into position for grabbing the football. Handoff up the middle. No, it'll be a play action. A fake to Fresh Knock. A killer pass across the middle to Sanders. He'll take it for a first down, breaking one tackle after another. He'll finally get up in it at the Holy Cross, 48 by John Smith, but not until he picks up a first and 10 orange and blue. Big run after catch, yards after catch, really impressive on that one. So Bachtel's defense bowed its back like Coach Cicchini wanted them to in our Geisinger Bison buildup. Cooper with his heels at the Bucknell 10. High snap, great grab by Wilkinson. He gets the punt block and Bucknell is recovered. Oh my almighty. Oh, Everybody came in, Ike Sibian Page may have blocked it and recovered the ball at the Holy Cross 37. Wow, that was not very well blocked, but the snap was the problem, Kevin. You're absolutely right, Douglas. That's what the problem is. That snap is high. The punter has to go way up in the air, and even though Bucknell did not send a, a, a whole house, they got one clean, and you're right. It was Page that came in there absolutely clean. See what Bittacoffer does. He'll be pressured, so he's going to tuck it in and run. He's going to run for a first down. He'll take it inside the Crusaders' 25, then get belted out of bounds at the 19. Second down and about six for Buckdale with 37 ticks and counting. First period, no score between the Crusaders and the Bison in Patriot League game number one of 2019. Bittacoffer will have fresh knock to his left in the shotgun. Two wideouts that way. In the slot is Sanders with the play clock down to 10. It'll be a pass out towards Sanders. He'll grab it. Coming to the near side, he'll make his way for a first and goal bicep. Pushed out of bounds at the Holy Cross. Four. Bucknell now moves left to right. Scoreless first quarter. No surprise for Holy Cross. At the two, it'll be a handoff to Fresh Knock. He'll twist. He'll turn. He will dive over the goal line for six. Touchdown! Your Bucknell Bison as Fresh Knock able to pick up his first rushing touchdown of the year. Remember, he missed all of last year, Kevin. It's so good to have him back. And that, I was going to say that. That has been a long time coming. Good push off the right side. Comes in, finds a little bit of a seat keeps those legs moving and instead of having to stretch the ball out over the end line at the 45 of Holy Cross he was taking hard to pass he'll look he'll throw and it'll be picked up by the Bison coming to the near side is Van Italy he has a convoy to the 10 to the 5 to the end zone touchdown your Bucknell Bison oh my almighty Van Italy was waiting on that pass. Sure was, sat back, hung out there, and read the quarterback's eyes the whole time. Stared him down and just stepped right in front, and all he saw was the hedges that say Bucknell behind the end zone, because there was no one else in front of him. Van Italy, who had that great game against Monmouth last year, makes it 13-0 Bucknell with 11.09 left in the half, and Dagenhart waited too long to make a pass so wide. Dagenhart, low snap, hands it off, no fires a pass, and it's going to be wide open of Mountain for a touchdown. Derek Mountain, the semifinalist for the Campbell Trophy, wide open, and Coach Chesney likes to go to that tight end. Going to be Dagenhart again, going with the quarterback keeper, and he'll push his way in for a touchdown for Holy Cross. And that was a good call on the line of scrimmage because he saw Bucknell was playing off just a little bit. It'll be third down, and here comes Bucknell going for it with a handoff. And Fresh Knock breaks it outside to the near side, and you'll get the first down. He gets pushed out of bounds into the, oh my, the sideline. And he will get pushed backwards, but five forwards, and I think he'll have the touchdown this time. Officials are trying to unpile all of the players for both teams. Well, the official on the near side had him a little short. And it is. Touchdown for the Crusaders. <laughs> Sanders in the slot on the near side. They'll shade a safety over that way on third and about 11. Long count. Here comes a blitz. It's picked up. Bittacoffer will throw. It's a dart. It'll be caught by Sanders. His first catch since the first quarter. 
and he'll take it for a first down all the way to the 46 yard line of Holy Cross. May well have one more opportunity offensively before this game ends here. Can Buckdale down seven with 8.59 left in the ball game, score on this drive. Here is a pass out of the backfield, it's tip, but Cooper will come away with it and he'll turn up field for a pickup of about seven. Second and 14, Bucknell all the way back to the Holy Cross 43, down by a touchdown and a point after are the Bison. It'll be a pass by Logan. He'll stop, he'll float one. There's a man there, Lyles. He'll catch it for a first down inside the Holy Cross 20. He'll race out of bounds at the 18. That was great offensive line blocking. Four yards in the blue. 